World Hearing Day is observed on 3rd of March every year to promote safety hearing, to provide inclusive society and to deal with preventing hearing loss. It is estimated that by 2050, about 1 in 10 people will end up having hearing loss, which is actually an alarming number. So it is important that we start taking actions on hearing loss and protect our hearing from now onwards, at least if it's not too late. So I would like to address a few myths that are going around regarding hearing loss. The first myth is that hearing loss is harmless. Actually, no. Hearing loss is a silent disability which many of us actually ignore. I'm sure we all have that one adult or one child who we come across on a daily basis who have a hearing problem. But what have we done about that? What problems do they face? Have we always recognized the kind of issues that they face and make any attempt to clear that? We need to ask this question to all of us. People with hearing loss face a lot of communication issues and they also have problems in identifying dangers around their environment. What if they go and they are at home and they are not able to you know, um, make out or they are not able to understand if there is a danger in, in, the, uh, I mean, in their surrounding. So we, ne we really need to think that hearing loss is not just a harmless issue, it is a harmful issue. And another myth that, that I would like to address here is that you cannot prevent hearing loss. We know that as people age, people generally tend to have difficulty in hearing. But what are we doing to delay this process? Or have we taken any measures to identify if we have a hearing problem at an early stage? This is something we need to think. So in those scenarios, and if we are able to adapt safe listening environments, then definitely hearing loss is preventable. Another myth that I would like to address here is that hearing aids do not work well. Hearing aids are one of the important devices which are given for prescribed for people with hearing loss based on the disability levels. So hearing aids are just one option. There are many other options like these. Those days we used to have hearing aids which generally produce a lot of noise which actually you know are very very loud causing a lot of dis discomfort. This is way back sometime about 15-20 years ago. Now with a lot of advancement in technology, hearing aids are adaptable. They are able to adapt to different environments. They are able to control the noise levels in the environments to the maximum extent possible and give a clear-cut speech signal which is going to help people with hearing loss.